chances are you've seen some of the best players in the world do this in a match to effortlessly waltz around their opponent. But what is it? And how do you do it? Actually, it's quite simple. It's called La Croqueta, and it's one of the most effective skill moves on the pitch. And today we're going to show you when and how to do it. And I'm going to do that rocking the David Beckham Predator remix from the Icon Pack that you can get your hands on still if you click the link right up there. You'll probably recognize La Croqueta as Andres Iniesta's signature move. And sure, he has done it a lot over the years. But once you start looking for it, you'll see that it's been used by every man and his dog on a weekly basis all over the world. Brought to fame by one of the most underrated bowlers ever, my fellow countryman Michael Laudrup, it's been used a lot by Messi, Busquets, Isco and Benzema in the recent years. We can see here that these top players use it to move closely around the defender while keeping the ball out of their reach and seducing them with this quick fluid skill. It's basically the simplest of moves, but still requires a whole lot of skill to pull off properly. And studying Laudrup and Iniesta, we can see how they manipulate the ball to keep it out of the reach of a defender sticking out his foot to tackle, and still somehow maintains this forward movement to go around the man with this quick rubber band-like motion. La Croqueta basically looks like two little kicks with the inside of your feet. And it is. Kinda. The first sideways move should be done as an inside scoop with the flat part of the instep. You shouldn't kick the ball here, no. You should instead move the foot with the ball, follow the ball a bit of the way while doing a small jump at the same time. After that, you want to end like croqueta. So after the scoop, you stick out the other foot, catch the ball with the instep and move it forward in a 90 degrees angle to move away from the defender. And from here on out, you need to focus on the jump and making the slide quick and smooth to be deceptive enough. And finally, you want to worry about getting your scooping foot out of the way so you don't get tackled. Of course, this looks easy in our super slow-mo, but it's a different thing pulling off in a match. So you want to make this second nature. I'd start out working on this on my own. And here you can make sure that everything has been hardwired into your brain by making all these little inside scoops between your feet, doing a little bit of jumping in between. Once you feel good about that, you want to make things a bit more difficult for yourselves. So here you can find some obstacles and basically just croquette your way around it. Now that could be a pole or a goal post or the photographer if you're out shooting a video, or basically any obstacle you can find wherever you're training this. Just remember to do the croquetta both with your strong foot, but also with your weak foot in order to be ready for everything you might encounter in a match situation. Once you feel comfortable with that, I'd bring in a friend but since I'm out here today, that's going to be a bit tricky to do. But thankfully, we did La Croqueta back in the days when I actually uh, had friends. And here you can see that if your friend comes in and puts out his foot simulating a tackle, it'll teach you not only when to do La Croqueta, but also how to do it outside of his reach. And if you take turns doing this, swapping between attacking and defending, it'll teach you that the right moment is just when the defender lunges and start putting out his foot. Skill, you're going to be able to waltz around defenders like Laudrup, Iniesta, Isco and the gang. And if you wear the Predator remakes doing so, well, you're going to look the business. 
didn't get a pair the first time round then, well, fear not, because our buying department is full of little geniuses, and they've secured a massive restock of the Predator's Remade boots, and you can get all of them this time if you click the link right over there. What you can also do is go and learn some more skills by clicking the playlist right down there, and then don't fool yourself out of the best football video content out there by subscribing to our channel with the notifications on by clicking right over there. And with that said, guys, I'm signing off. Cheerio.